Hello people of the earth and welcome back to Quick Safe TV. My name is Mike and today we're going to do something um, uh, not so much unusual as much as it is rare, right? Because it's not always done and it's not done in uh, huge numbers because because it means uh, it takes a lot of labor, you know what I mean? It takes a lot, a lot, a lot of hard work to accumulate this much materials or a lot of capital. In my case, it took me about 15 hours to accumulate all of this and... It's interesting because you don't always look at those things, but it's always nice to take a look at what is the general chance to get stuff. The key difference of my research compared to other research done in this direction, to which I will provide links in the description, there's about three of them. They are done, two of them done almost a year ago, over a year ago, and one of them is done seven months ago. Now, the key difference of mine is that I have specifically 10,000 rawhide scraps, which makes it more, you know, narrowed down, even though I think the chance is the same. It's also the same chance for different types. It's the same for smithing, clothing, leatherworking, and woodworking. So it's the same thing. But it's interesting. And it's also done on the version of the game 215, which is the Imperial City DLC. Uh, and it's, you know, it's the fifth patch of the DLC. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and decon all of it. I wonder how much time it will take. 20 minutes later. All right, after 20 minutes of non-stop refining, what we're going to do right now is we're going to calculate what we've managed to accomplish, what we've managed to get, and count the total percentages of everything. Now, unlike previous researches, I'm also going to count the weapon armor traits and the total amount of refined materials. Stand by, I'm going to be back in a couple of seconds. A few moments later. Okay, now finally, after compiling all the data and calculating everything, I decided to go a step further and I've added to my own research the former research of De Jeff Turner, Fat Cat 45, and Chromazone, right? Altogether, it's, it's a pretty interesting data, but I don't get whether I'm super fucking lucky or the drop, change, the drop rates of the gold upgrade materials have changed, right? So my research suggests that the green upgrade drops are 17%, blue are about 12 purple about 9 gold are about 6 and then you have about 85% of the raw material becomes refined. The weapon trades drop at about 13%. Armor trade at about 14%. I expect weapon and armor trades are about the same drop chance. It doesn't really tell me anything. And refined materials would be something about 80 to 85%, right? So you get most of the stuff you refine uh, as your refined material. Uh, regarding the gold, it, it, it seems very inconsistent when compared to Jeff Turner's Fat Cats and Chromosome's research. A thing to note, however, is that Jeff Turner's and Fat Cats uh, 45's research was largely focused on uh, uh, ores, right, which is interesting. And Chromosome's research, which was the last one and done seven months ago, was focused, wasn't really focused on anything. It had a little bit of everything. So, which leads me to believe that either the gold upgrades have increased in drop rates, right, or, uh, or I was just incredibly lucky. Regardless of what it is, I leave it up to you to decide. But, you know, take this data with a grain of salt. We'd need a lot more of those. We'd need like 10 of those, you know what I mean? To really calculate it. And even though all of those were super significant, Jeff Turner refined 1,000 mats, Fat Cat 1,000 mats, Chromosome refined 2,000 times, right? We're talking like tw uh, in total 40,000 mats and me now 10,000 mats more. So it's 50,000 raw materials refined and... This is what we've got, right? So I hope it was helpful to you. It was actually for me. I'm quite excited. It seems that the gold rates, gold drop rates has increased. I do not know when, but it's fun, man. It's fun. And it only took me, what, about 16 hours to do all of this? Combined with the editing of this video will be like, what, uh, 16 and a half, 17 hours? Great, man. I like to burn time on meaningless things. It's, it's, it's fantastic. I hope you're going to have a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching and listening, uh, and I'll see you soon.